Yeah, welcome back to my channel. You welcome back to Taron Innovative for the home of creativity and exploit. If today is the first time of seeing this channel, do well by subscribing. All you need to do is click on the subscribe button and do not forget to like this video. I believe that watching this video will even convince you to subscribe to this channel. All right, thank you so much to all our old time subscribers. God bless you. All right, so let's dive into today's tutorial. Okay, I'm going to be teaching you another beautiful and bag okay so you can use it as gift bag you can use it personally you can give it as gift you can sew it as souvenir if you're a bag maker all right so you're welcome as we dive into the um tutorial okay so this is what we're using we're using this beautiful leather material okay uh -huh. and then what do i need the measurement of this bag is 12 inches by 25 and a half inches that's 25.5 inches okay the wideness is 12 while the length is 25 and a half that's 25.5 inches okay all right so you if you want to measure it in centimeter you can do likewise so in centimeter it will be 31 it will be 30.5 in 30.5 centimeter by by 64 and a half centimeter all right so i think that is that about that okay guys so this is the zip side okay the zip side is four by ten inches four by ten inches ten inches while the main bag is 12 inches okay so take note of that okay and then this is for the side okay the side is four inches by nine and a half that's 9.5 inches you need two of it while the handle is um 17 inches each you need two of it okay and then i'll be using my zip cloth and my zip head all right so now this is the zip side this is the zip okay i said four by ten right so i'm going to cut it into two okay so that's making two by ten right inches you see what i'm going to be doing here see i'm going to uh stitch here and I'm going to stitch here all right so now what I'm going to do here is so this is my So just trim off all the essence that you know, right? So now the next thing I'm going to do is see. Hmm? I want to ensure that um, I'm doing the right thing because it must face each other. So see what just do the way I I did this, okay, guys, so that you get it. Because if you don't do it that way, if you just like do this one separately without checking if they are actually facing each other, you may it won't be the same. Like when you are done, this one may be here and then the other one will now come and it will be opposite. So just follow this the way I did, please. That is the correct way. So 
so let me do it for this side i think it will be much more easier for me guys so see this one so i'm going to cut off this one because i don't need it okay i'm going to also cut this off because i don't need it okay so the next thing is i'm going to be fixing my zip head okay So I'm going to fix my zip knot and zip head. So see. Okay. But it's not very balanced. I think it's okay now okay so let's get the center the midpoint is very important eh? okay so get the center of the main body to the main bag to get the center that's the mid the mid point the middle or the half okay so this one also I'm going to get the center of one of the sides. Okay, so I'll top stitch where I did not um, notch. Okay. Are you still doubting me to subscribe or not? I think you should be convinced by now that. This is where you should subscribe. So, right? This channel is where you should subscribe to. Okay, guys. So, I'll drop this one aside, okay? So, let's quickly do something. So, not this one too. Okay? You, you get why? There's, reason, there's a reason behind that, okay? For the work to be accurate. Okay, guys so let's fix our handle so now do you know why this is important the notching now see it will just help me to get the medium the midpoint easily so i just shifted it this way okay so i will now top stitch okay so my handle will be here so it should be around three so from this point to this point it should be around three okay so see three so i'll also bring my handle here i hope it does not pass here too should be three yes three See what I'll do. I'll stitch it again by bringing the See what I have. I'll repeat the same thing to this side. Okay. You see. I said the middle is very important, right? So that it will not um tilt to the side to one side it will be, so that it will be balanced so for this one and i don't even need to measure it because where this handle is will give me a clue you see i'll also come here
I want to do it straight forward. So see the point, get the middle, shift it a bit, bring it this way, like trace it with your hand. Make sure it doesn't leave your hand or better still you can remove the zip and fix it back later. See what I'm doing. This is the fastest means of doing this, okay? So see. So this is what you do until you now get to the top. What we do here, we repeat the same procedure on the other side. So repeat the same procedure here. So the next thing is this place. Okay, so our bag is almost ready.